All right, that should be good. Hey, uh, we just split the VOD here. Hey, what's up? How's it going, gamers? I don't think we're gonna do all three Spy Fox games today, Got but we'll do them at milk? some point. Not anymore. Everything is going just as I planned. Soon the entire world will be without dairy milk. No butter on toast, no ice cream, no cheddar cheese, and nothing but dry cereal. Nothing can stop me now. <laughs> Somewhere oh, over the I do have to fix that. Sea. I'll fix it in a moment. Like our Italian entree, sir? No thanks. It gives me hives. Our vegetarian dinner then. But once no, the game gives me, uh, the gives me an option, I'm just gonna tab out real quick. I thought it was good, may but. I recommend the Greek plate. It's delicious. All right. It's, it's a little bit more cut off. Enjoy. I was like, that looks fine. I can't really tell. I have to guess. It's good to see you, Agent Fox. Ah. Monkey Penny. Now this is This a is a joke I didn't get as a kid. Her name is Monkey Yesterday, Penny instead of Money Penny. Operatives discovered the factory and offices of Amalgamated Moo Juice Incorporated abandoned and drained Juice. of milk. Soon the entire world's remaining milk reserves will be depleted. The idea of eating dry breakfast cereal is pretty hard to swallow. Yes, it is. Here's the only clue we have. Feta cheese. A low grade, too. Spy operatives took that picture in the office of Mr. Howard Hugh Heffer Utterly III. President and CEO of Amalgamated Moo Juice Incorporated. Exactly. We presume he has valuable information on the dairy crisis. The only available picture of him is hidden in your mashed potatoes. Finding Utterly is your top priority. He shouldn't be hard to spot. The feta cheese samples found in Utterly's office have been traced back to the island of Acidophilus. Your plane will be flying over the island any minute now. I've already set up the mobile command center where you'll rendezvous with me and later on with Quack. The entrance code is in your fortune cookie. Any questions? No, I'm on my way. Good. Monkey Penny, out. Okay. At this point, we should be able to tab out of the game in just a moment. If I can fix this. Okay. At this point, I give me I one second. My parachute in my other tuxedo. Maybe one of my special spy gadgets will help me. Or, I wonder which one I should pick. Yeah, that that should work. Let's try this one. The one time I don't need. So, who here has never played a humongous entertainment? I played a couple of these on stream. What good is this without helium? Yeah, if you want to learn more about pens, uh, go to uh, penisland.com. Uh, penismightier.com is also pretty good. Hmm. So this is the sleepy little Greek island of Acidophilus. I grew up with this game. Uh, this and Pajama Sam were my faves. I did all of Pajama Sam on stream. I should meet up with Monkey Penny at the Mobile Command Center. Five 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 one three nine four. How fortunate that Monkey Penny gave me this entrance code. I'm so glad I don't have that stupid monkey here that was so bad at doing math. Hello, Spycore Mobile Command Center. Penny, I've got your number. I think Spy Fox might have been my favorite, because I always loved James Bond. Now that's a person-to-person -person phone call. Glad you could drop in, Spy Fox. Hello, monkey. That's Monkey Penny. So what do you think of Skycorp's new Greek Island Mobile Command Center? Impressive. Disguising it as a half-buried boat in the middle of the town square was a stroke of genius. Nobody would ever notice that. That. And yeah, for those of you who have played a humongous game, what, what was your spy? favorite? Oh, he'll be here soon to refill the spy gadget vending machine. In the meantime, he sent a couple of things ahead for your mission. Good. 
because a spy without a gadget is like a shopping cart without a broken wheel. How apt. Now pay attention. This is Greek money. It's called drachmas. You may need to buy a few things around here on the island. Well, they teach you what drachma is. And this is a, a toothbrush. And I sure could use one after that airplane meal. Don't put that in your mouth. It's not a regular toothbrush. It's a special laser toothbrush. Let me show you how it works. You hold the laser toothbrush, apply the minty fresh laser gel, push Gotta be minty a button, fresh. then you can use it to cut through really thick steel. Hmm, I guess that's one way to fight cavities. So, do we have any idea where Mr. Utterly is being held? No solid evidence yet, but you might want to check out that feta factory down by the docks. Feta factory, huh? I thought I smelled something suspicious. Got some pretty cool items. Uh, Monkey Penny, did I ask her some questions about the time the demented Dr. Gemini created a clone of me, and I had to stop myself from beating myself up? I wish you'd get a hold of yourself and get going on this rescue mission. Rude. This part is clicking on random things. It, it just does a whole lot of stuff. need to get to that feta fact. I sure wish Quack would get here so I could get some more of those nifty spy gadgets. Happy hour. That's not a thing for My a kid's game. My spy watch is beeping. Spy Fox to Mobile Command Center. Please no, I said the best by. part is. Spy Fox here. Hi, Spy Fox. Remember, you can call me via your spy watch anytime for help and information. Yeah, the best part is always clicking on random things. Will do. Spy Fox, out. It says trinkets. Hey, wanna see my tattoo? Here's Popeye. What a cool tattoo. Look at this. God damn. That's impressive. Your mother must be so proud. A weird pull about. We got fun. Bucket, happy fun sub. Everybody Any loves fun. From the spy biz might do me some good. Got it. How do you feel about uh, fun? You, it's a submarine. You get it? You get it? Look at that. It's so cool. You're into fun. Is there anyone in chat who wouldn't press the fun button? You had fun once, it was terrible. But yeah, I've been there. There are three Spy Fox games and they made two spin-offs. I own them all. The cool thing about them is that they're like sort of randomized. You wouldn't know this unless you play them more than once, but uh, they are they are a bit randomized. You get like different objectives you have to do. You're all that fun. B Mobile Command Center. It's a photograph of Mr. Utterly. It's a it's a photograph of Mr. Utterly. My fox was so cool though. The door's locked. It says happy hour 12 to 2. I'm gonna tell people what happy hour is, Spy Fox? No? There's something fun about just clicking random shit like this. It says Greek Cantina. I feel like calling it the Greek Cantina is really redundant when you are already in Greece. I guess the cantina doesn't serve breakfast. Well, I have to say that's the first time I've ever been grateful I ate the airplane meal.
there's just there's just a magic about these games that I'm always happy to come back to, no matter how old I get. I'm like, these were good at teaching. Ah, the Feta Factory. Acme Tuna. Cheese. Ow. Oh, it's acne. Never mind. Of course. Uh oh, normally I would correct. No, the milk. Hi, Jumny. You know a lot about milk. I mean, I mean, what? Seems to be made of solid steel. How we get mega milkers now? That's the best part. You don't. He's so cool, Spy Fox. They should have made more games with him. They only made three. Yummy, what are you up to? The laser toothbrush makes impervious steel doors pervious. You should go follow Jumny. Jumny's a, a stinky cat, but we we love Jumny. Now that's a big side of beef. No buts about it. That's Mr. Utterly, all right. Me, every time and I see a picture of a butt, I'm like. Nah. Now the question is, how am I going to get this rump roast down from? Yeah, me? you missed uh, Dora the Explorer. Trey, uh, <laughs> he got really bullied. Gee, Mr. Utterly, for a cow, someone sure has you hogged. Think he trash panda? Been an yeah, rodeo. and maybe that lever will help me get Mr. Utterly's rump roast down from there. We might do all three games today. We'll we'll see how time goes. Hang in there, Mr. Utterly. These games are all pretty I short. Almost got this thing figured out. Cow wrangling wasn't covered in my spy manual. <laughs> Hmm, this must be the temperature control for this pool of piranhas. Kind of an odd fixture for a feta cheese factory. The piranha pool seems to be getting hotter. Fish will get more upset the higher you do this. They're not gonna boil alive so I wonder what a South American fish that can eat creatures alive has to do with making cheese. I have a feeling this is no ordinary feta factory. That makes the piranha pool colder. Cold? You know, this topic came up in another stream recently. How, chat, do you like cold showers? I do. I don't always take cold showers, but like on a hot day, cold showers are like such a game changer. Hmm, fish on ice. That should hold them. Now for Mr. Utterly. Also, Gemini, how, how is 14? Are you done with the story? Ah, uh, damn, they're like me when I see a butt. I didn't, I didn't say anything. You're the weirdo. You saved me! Thank you, Mr. Um. Uh, Fox. Day two of early access? God damn, Jumbo. Rescue, really? Now I need to get you to our mobile command center for a D. Yeah, on a really hot day, if it's like 90 out, it's just like. Take a cold shower, it's a game changer. It's not even like freezing, it's just like, oh, that feels great. Why don't you start from the beginning? You did it. Tell us what happened. You did a 40 hour stream? Oh, that's not good, Jumbo. This is, this is why you're a stinky cat, doing 40 hours. cattle calls and reviewing grazing reports. Yep, you have to stay pretty sharp in the dairy biz. Be careful, you don't want to do 40 hour streams or 24. They're they're pretty bad for you, all things considered. That's why I don't want to do one. We are gonna do a big one though on uh Tuesday. There were dozens of them. I fought them hoof and Dozens, all two of them. How I did. My whole body's a weapon. Then suddenly, I smelled something revolting. It could only be one thing. Feta cheese! cheese. Feta cheese is delicious! The was so overwhelming that I nearly passed out. Taking advantage of my momentary asphyxiation, kidnappers jumped me and then forced me into a smelly dark bag. They whisked me away to Kid's Secret Island Fortress. It was just so humiliating being bagged up like a... like a piece of beef. 
But were you able to learn anything about what William the King That's what I call one slab of meat. Oh, Ooh. Bovine ingenuity on my part, I picked a few things up. Kids demented scheme for gaining worldwide domination is run by a front company called Nectar of the Goats Corporation. Nectar of the Goats is a <laughs> great name. First, capture all the dairy cows in the world. Yeah, this is me showing my plans to people. This is exactly how it goes. He built that milky weapon of destruction in Ron Gilbert the hates forces. feta cheese. Third, use the milky weapon of destruction to flood the capital with none too fresh dairy milk. Fourth, frame all the poor dairy cows for this heinous crime. Yeah, you know, we always send Jumney to horny jail, but I think we gotta send Jumney to cow jail. I think that's the right place to go. to find that secret fortress and disarm that milky weapon of destruction. Hmm, sounds challenging. I need to find that secret fortress and disarm that milky weapon of destruction. Oh, I almost forgot! When William the Kid's back was turned, I swiped the secret code that turns the milky weapon of destruction off! Good going! Where is it? Uh, well, I had to swallow the code before I could read it so it wouldn't be discovered. Can you believe it? I found oh, no. the whole thing a little hard to swallow. We need to figure out a way to get a look at that code. Someone needs to find that secret fortress and- If only there was like some kind of x-ray vision we had, chat. Good morning, Spy Fox. I took the liberty of loading the vending machine- That always reminds me of like Bentley. Duck? Spy gadget. You should take a look the earthquake was earlier today, Jomni. I don't have the duck. Jomni, did you, uh, did you feel that? No. It was pretty bad. How does this work, Professor Quack? Ah, oh, that's my new and improved beef flavor x-ray gum. It's kind of fucked up. You can't just say beef flavor in front of a cow. I'll explain how it works. You take a stick out, put it up against something beefy, move it around, and then you can see the yucky stuff inside. The best part of all is, when you are done, you can chew the gum. It actually has a very refreshing, beefy flavor. You know, four out of five dentists prefer x-ray gum for their patients who need x-rays. Yeah, do you agree this is kind of dark? A duck needs his fiber. What's in this egg-shaped container, Professor Quack? The silly putty, I remember this. This is a little gadget I call the spy putty. I love silly putty. This is something that gamers today wouldn't Open understand. Open the cute little egg container and spread the putty on whatever you want to make a copy of. Press down and then peel the putty I tried off. to cover Lonely and Silly Putty off. once, so I could always hmm. have her around when uh, she's at work. I know what you're Didn't work. You think that it was just like, stop covering me in putty. It's a lot like that silly stuff they sell in toy stores. What you don't know is that I thought of it first. Those duplicitous duplicators stole my idea. That's the spy putty. You only have four gadgets at once. I'm gonna choose. It appears to be a shoe. What is this gadget, Professor Quack? Oh, that's the night vision shoe. The night One vision of my shoe. Most ingenious the classic. Anyone wear shoes at night? Now you may be asking. Spy Fox you doesn't need shoes. He walks around barefoot. All you You'd be right. Strap the shoe onto your head, and then you can see in the dark. How illuminating! Spy Fox was the original shoe on head. You remember when people yeah. do that? Put shoes and on their head. Excellent arch support. That's the night vision shoe. We take six. Okay, let's take this one. Mmm, it looks like a delicious snack. May I eat this, Professor Quack? Okay, that's the cheese and safe cracker kit. It Voices will help Nancy Drew's you dad. Almost okay. any safe in the world. I won't explain exactly how they call it safe. Then how come I could break into it? Like make gamers. Trust me when I say Do they even still make cheese and crackers shot. like this with the red and stick? Oh, I used to love soup. like trying to play with that stick. Yeah. Be like, yeah, check it out. 
I'd like put like a thing of cheese on him so he looks like he has some hair. That's the cheese and safe cracker. Uh, what has this guy done? Who's the duck? Now, if you don't mind, Mr. Utterly, I'm going to need to use this x-ray gum to take a look at those four stomachs of yours. This isn't going to hurt, is it? Because I get kind of dizzy when I think about pain. In fact, just saying the word pain makes me want to... in every humongous oh. game. I believe it. Professor Quack, your x-ray gum works perfectly. I can see everything inside. Mr. Oh my Utterly. god, the inside of this guy's stomach is terrible. Look at that, he's eating clocks! I found the note. All right, now I need to find out where that... Poppy Joes. Is. Then use it to disarm the milky weapon of destruction. Steak roast. Oh my god, this is so dark. Eat low. Press yes. What'd you do for the sauce? His ticker looks like it needs winding. It looks like I need to find that key. But you just bought a sauce package? Gotta find that key. I've got to look for that key. William the Kid must be stopped. Without that... Here's where I, I ask myself, if I were an evil, twisted, misguided... That's his ticker? What do you mean his ticker? Where would I put my secret portrait? You can't just say that. Oh, this guy. I remember this bunny. He's a jerk. Welcome to the Trinket Emporium. My name is Gilbert. How may I be of service? I guess this is Ron Gilbert. Honorable visitor to this, our dear island home. I'm not sure yet. I was just noticing your fine selection of trinkets. Sir, I think that you will find we offer much more than mere trinkets. We pride ourselves in having the island's finest selection of rare and hard to find collector items and antiquities. Excellent. One never knows when they will be struck with an unquenchable desire to indulge in a blatant act of bourgeois consumerism. Our That's thoughts exactly, sir. Sir, could I interest you in this nice looking, uh, shoot. What are they called? It has something to do with the sound seltzers make when you plop them into water. Fizz? Yes, exactly. Can it's a I fizz. interest you in a nice fizz? I once heard some interesting trivia about sailors' hats. That must have been a fascinating experience for you. Could you tell me a little about those pennants? Yes, those were actual pennants weighed by Emperor Theodosius himself at the 393 AD Olympics. Do you have any bigger fish? You should have seen the one that got away. Wait just one away. moment. Could that possibly be the ship's steering wheel from the Titanic? I have a sinking suspicion it might be, sir. Wait a minute. I, this is game is really dark. Teddy Roosevelt teddy bear? Circa 1902? Yes, they are so, very rare. Teddy They're Roosevelt even exists, even though everyone is a furry? List. How much is that cute stuffed kitty you have there? It is a little expensive, sir. But I would be happy to throw in some free stuffed kitty litter. Cool. Greetings from Evo. Are you actually at Evo? Are you at Evo, I see? That's crazy. Uh, have you found Hihachi? I hear he's alive. Interesting. Is that an entire jar of trinkets? Yes, my Aunt Elisa pickles them every September. So, what's a jar of trinkets going for these days? Normally, sir, God damn it, Mooch. That's a band. Show you, up right when there's a, a Banui. Sounds good to me. I'll take it. There you go, sir. Why, thank you.
There's no telling when I might need one of these hats. You'd better give me 40 of them. 40? But I only have one left. All right. I'll take How are you doing, Mooch? You want to you tell us about bunnies? Good. I hope you and your little hat will be happy together. Classic. Have a nice day. Right, where should we? Can't get in there until someone unlocks the door. Hey there, gamer. Excuse me, are you the owner of this boat? I'm James T. Drydock. Captain Gotta cause your the chaos SS here? No, no chaos. Pleased to meet you. My name's Fox. What kind of mushrooms are these? Fox. Is this rickety old boat of yours seaworthy? 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 Of course she's seaworthy. The question is not whether she's seaworthy, maybe, Pretty good. but rather whether you're worthy of the sea. I see. That's not going to do me any good. No need for a disguise here. So, how are the fish biting today, Captain? Same way they usually do. They use their jaw muscles to push their teeth together. That's quite a nice little toy boat you got there. Is it yours? Oh, yes, sir. And that is why I'm standing out here at this podium on this filthy, e evil you can just dock, say. talking to a sophisticated wannabe like you. So it's not your boat? No. It belongs to my boss. If we can find anything. I'm glad that ice held Mr. Utterly. Go. Thankfully, you can skip in these games. Makes it go faster. Oh, this guy's so cool. Look at his hair. Welcome to the cantina. I'm B Bear. If there's anything I can get you, sugar, like for example, sugar, you just let me know. All right. Thanks, B. So, what does the traditional Greek food taste like? I don't know. It's all Greek to me. <laughs> so, what do you suggest from the menu? Last time I suggested something, I got sued for malpractice. So my attorney advised me not to make any more suggestions. Mm-mm. What's cooking back there? Something smells good. Oh, that's the plumber scraping out the clogged drain. Ooh. What's the story with the gravity-challenged card player over there? Oh, honey, watch out for him. That's Mr. Big Pig. The local mud baron. He's a notorious go fish player. Yeah, that's MC. That MC. Hey, thanks for the raid. How's it going? So B, how's your coffee? Mine is great, but they won't let me serve it here. But can I offer you some of the local sludge we call sua especial? What can you tell me about that slick-looking lounge lizard over there? Him? Oh, that's Johnny Gecko. He wants to be the next MC. Liberal did you did you hear they announced Johnny Gecko for Evo? That kind of He's gonna be in Guilty Gear as the crossover character. So, is the food here any good? Well, between you and me, sweetie, let's just say it's no coincidence that you don't see any rats in this part of town. How's business been since the milk shortage began? It's been difficult for some of the customers. How are you enjoying Evo? themselves away, but I have a high lactose intolerance, so it hasn't really affected me. Tell me, B, what's a bright, How many more days are left? Like you doing in a rundown cantina like this? I ask myself that every morning, honey. So, B, how's your coffee? Mine. Well, tonight was the last night. Hell yeah, but they won't let me serve it here. But can I offer you some of the local sludge we call sua especial? What's the trophy for? That's my cockadoodle foo trophy. I took lessons from Master Hong Kong Doodle, at least until I punched his stuffing out. Hell yeah. What's the special today, B? Fat free egg foo not so young anymore. How's the fat free egg foo not so young anymore? I think that actually is dependent so on what day of the week it is. Not so young either. Here's 
a number that goes out to all you white tux wearing spies. You can't just say someone is a spy. I, I can't believe Spy Fox just introduces himself to her and going, hey, my name's Spy Fox. Check it out. Interested in a little game of go fish, Mr. Fox? Spy Fox. I've been known to play Go Fish from time to time, and you are? Artemis J. Big Pig. Pleased to make your acquaintance, sir. What do you say we make this game a little more interesting? Would you care to play with some trinkets? I just happen to have a whole jar of trinkets. <laughs> Excellent, then. I like a fox who is willing to play for trinkets with a pig who likes to play Go Fish for trinkets. Place your trinkets on the table, and we'll get started. He's so wide. I mean, he's basically a Bond villain, yeah. So, you like playing for trinkets, eh? All right, I'm game. Here's my trinket. Let's play. That's a lovely trinket you have there, sir. That's a very cool I'll trinket. This one. Got any queens? What a fun game this is. Got any kings? <laughs> go fish. Fishing. Mario, you're gonna have to go Got fishing. Any threes. Nice try, but you need to go fish. Go fish yourself. Nerd. Got any aces? Got any twos? Go fish, Mr. Fox. Got any kings? Fuck you. Got any jacks? Nope. Go fish. Why don't we get a top six of this? You're seeing it right now. Threes? Got any fours? A card. Thank you so much. Got any fives? What a fun game this is. What Got a fun game, he says, only because he's winning. Go fish, sir. Got any nines? Nice try, but you need to go fish. Go fish yourself. Got any tens? Not a one, sir. Go fish. I asked for a ten, not a one. Got any jacks? Go fish. Got any kings? I'll just take those off your hands. Hell yeah. This suits me just fine. Suit yourself. Got any sixes? No, sir. Go fish. Got any sevens? Go fish. Got any twos? Okay. Got any queens? Not a one, sir. Go fish. Not very good at this game. Got any nines? Go fish. Got any tens? <laughs> Go fish. Got any sevens? Nope. Go fish. Got any fours? A card. Thank oh, yeah. you so much. Got any they ask about aces. aces? Go fish, Mr. Fox. Okay. Got any jacks? Nice try. You really want those jacks. Go fish. Got any threes? No, sir. Go fish. Got any sevens? Nice try, but you need to go fish. Got any fives? Go fish, sir. What the hell? Got any nines? Go fish. What? Am I getting all of the cards? What is going on? Got any sixes? A card. Thank you so much. I love this game. Got any aces? No, sir. Go fish. I've always been lucky when it comes to go fish. Got any sevens? Nope. Go fish. Hmm. Got any twos? Go fish, Mr. Fox. Got any queens? You take them. I don't want them. Got any seven? God damn it, no! Got any queens? Nice try. What the fuck? You, just, go fish. you stupid idiot! You just asked me! Got any tens? Not a one, sir. Go fish. I don't know if this guy is playing with Got a full deck. Eights. What? Got any queens? 
Nice try, but you need to go fish. <laughs> I hope you are not easily discouraged, sir. Now I can talk to Mr. Big Pig about some of the folks I've met on the island. I've played almost everyone on the island, sir. And I never met anyone who plays quite like you. You may be a very shrewd player, sir, but I hope you don't mind if I hog all the winnings. <laughs> yeah, because he's big. Have you tried the food here, sir? It's the best on the island, I can assure you. I can't get enough of it. Got any aces? <laughs> Go fish. Got any eights? Go fish. Oh. Taking your sevens. Ah, how delightful. That gives me a suit, sir. Got any sevens? I'll just take those off your hands. That's one set of cards taken care of. Got any threes? Go fish, sir. Okay. Mario's gonna have to go fishing. This suits me just fine. Got any jacks? I thought you said you were good at this game. Damn. Got any aces? No, sir. Go fish. That was kind of mean. Got any threes? <laughs> Gad, I'm good. Got any eights? No. <laughs> Got any jacks? Nope. Go fish. Got any fours? Not a one, sir. Go fish. Hmm. Got any... I'd actually be. I must apologize, sir. I am rather good at this game. <laughs> Got any eights? Go fish. What the f you said you're good at this game. Got any aces? Go fish, Mr. Fox. Got any fours? Uh oh, he's gonna ask for the eight. That's all he's at. Ah, uh, yes. Another one for me, sir. Got any eights? No! And that makes a set, sir. Got any jacks? Nice try, but you need to go fish. He's gonna win here. Watch, he's gonna pull that. Ah, how delightful. Got any jacks? Nice try, but you need to go fish. Got any aces? What a fun game this is. I love this game. I think we actually just tied. It looks like neither one of us wins this round, Mr. Big Pig. I think you have to beat him, right? What I forget. What? Here's where I... I'm sure glad this spy gadget vending machine doesn't have a no deep. Think he was cheating? He was cheating. Policy. I was winning until he decided to play the game. Is this coin really a spy gadget, Professor Quack? Ah, that's the spy trap. Let me explain how it works. It looks like an ordinary coin, like you might find in the street. But if you need to trap three or more bad guys, the coin explodes and a net shoots out. It traps the naughty spy enemies. Nice, huh? Heads I win, tails they lose. I'm going to lose my appetite if I keep this up. What handsome cufflinks. Are they gadgets as well, Professor Quack? Those are the suction cufflinks. I am very proud of them. They the are so many suction God, cups that allow you to climb across non-porous metal surfaces. The perfect fashion accessory for the well-dressed spy. Mmm, that was a tasty one. Those are the suction cufflinks. Oh no, if I run into two or less bad guys, what am I gonna do? Hey, wanna see my tattoo? He's got a new tattoo now, hell yeah.
So, Captain, do you think you could take me out for a little boat ride? I'd love to, but there's just one problem. I can't go anywhere without my lucky charm. Your lucky charm? I, matey. I do have to get because it. Because that there is the sea, the final frontier. And my voyages on the SS. I don't know why he's, for some reason, Shatner. I love it. new sea life and new civilizations. I boldly went where no raccoon has gone before. But without my lucky charm, it would be way too risky. I can't chance it. I can gather information about Captain Drydock and his lucky charm with this. Would you place your trinkets on the table and we'll get started. Sure. This is a fun card game. Shall we play again? If you wish to, but I must warn This time, I Shatner must impressions never stopped really being big. Now I can talk to Mr. Big Pig about some of the folks I've met on the island. What do you know about Captain Drydock and his missing lucky charm? <laughs> Pearl Sap lost it in a particularly tense game of Go Fish. Oh, really? So this is the lucky charm then? Mm, yes, and I won't give it up easily. And you know that Go Fish is my game. That's a charming little charm you have there. What? This old trinket? Merely a worthless bobble I had the pleasure of winning in an intriguing Go Fish match several weeks ago. So, Mr. Big Pig, how did you win that lucky charm? By having the most matches at the end of the game, sir. <laughs> how else? I think we just beat Got him and then we get it. Twos? Not a one, sir. Go fish. Got any aces? Got any fours? Oh my god, no, stop! Got any sixes? I thought you said you were good at this game. Go fish. A damn. Got any jacks? Go fish, sir. Oh no, I'm gonna do bad this time. Got any fives? Oh. Got any aces? Go fish. Got any threes? Got any eights? <laughs> Go fish. Got any nines? Nice try, but you need to go fish. Mario's game gallery prepare you. Delightful. That gives me a suit, sir. Got any kings? No, sir. Go fish. You get one so early. Sixes? Nice try, but you need to go fish. He's cheating. Got any queens? Go fish, Mr. Fox. Got any jacks? Dude. I'm getting scammed. Got any nines? I can't believe this. My match made in heaven, sir. Got any sixes? Nope. Go fish. Got any eights? No, sir. Go fish. Got any queens? Oh my god. I'm getting scammed. I'm getting scammed. Fives. Go fish. Got any sixes? Got any eights? Not a one, sir. Go fish. Okay. Got any twos? Oh, I was about to ask for that, too. <laughs> I hope you are not easily discouraged, sir. I am. Very easily Got discouraged. Queens. Nice try, but you need to go fish. Got any threes? Go fish, Mr. Fox. Dad, I'm not gonna win this. Got any sixes? Got any fives? Nope, go fish. Ah, how delightful. Got any queens? Nice try. I don't think I can win this. Go fish. Yes, I'm good. Got any kings? <laughs> go fish. Just have nothing. Got any fives? Go fish. Got any eights? Go fish, sir. Got any sevens? Bruh. Got any 
jacks. Nope. Go fish. Got any tens? No, sir. Go fish. I can't win. Got any kings? Got any jacks? Go fish. Ah, how delightful. And that makes a set, sir. Got any seven? Nice try, but you need to you go You basically fish. need more than six. Ah, how did I got any? Go fit. Alright, let's... I hate... Can we start? Your trinkets on the table and we'll get started. Got any tens? No, sir. Go fish. Okay, let's try again. Ten. Got any fours? This is a good go hand fish. in Bellatro, right, chat? Got any kings? <laughs> go fish. Got any sevens? Got any eights? I was just about to ask for that too. God damn it. It's a cheater. Got any threes? Nice try, but you need to go fish. Got any fives? Go fish, Mr. Fox. I've always been lucky when it comes to go fish. I don't think you have. Got any Fox. aces? Not a one, sir. Go fish. I've always been lucky when it comes to go fish. He's got a mirror. I can believe he cheats. Got any queens? Go fish, sir. Got any sixes? Nope. Go fish. Got any... Tens? <laughs> Go fish. Got any twos? I thought you nope. said you were good at this game. Go fish. I am sweating like a pig. You Got know he was earlier. Fives? Go fish. Yo, Wang, what's up? How's it going? Raid. Got any eights? Nice try, but you need to go fish. Thanks for the raid. Got any jacks? Got any queens? No, sir. Go fish. All knife stories? What does that even mean? Got any nines? Nice try, but you need to go fish. Got any kings? Go fish, sir. Talked about some all knives today. That's gaming. Got any sevens? Nope. Go fish. He said he asked for two earlier. Got any twos? I'll just take those off your hands. Got any tens? Not a one, sir. Go fish. I love this game. Got Maybe. any sixes? Go fish. I have sixes. Got any fives? <laughs> go fish. I've always Gaming. been lucky when it comes to go fish. Got Look at my in raiders, though. Uh, we're going go through fish. a spy fox. Sweating. Got any jacks? Not a one, sir. Go fish. Got any fives? Bruh. I was gonna ask that next turn. <laughs> I hope you are not easily discouraged, sir. Got any fours? Nice try, but you need to go fish. And that makes a set, sir. Got any eights? Got any queens? No, sir. Go fish. Got any sixes? Nice I don't try. have sixes. Stop Let's asking for sixes. That's so bad at this game. Got any aces? Go fish, Mr. Fox. Dang. Got any kings? I don't ask for. Got any sevens? Go fish. Fuck you, I'm taking your sixes. Got any sixes? I'll just take those off your hands. This suits me just fine. Got any eights? Go fish, sir. Got any aces? I must apologize, sir. I am rather good at this game. Mm -hmm. Got any kings? My god, he's cheating. Look at this! A match made in heaven, sir. Got any nines? Nice try, but you need to go fish. Ah, yes. 
Another one for me, sir. I'm still winning. Got any queens? Go fish, Mr. Fox. That's one set of cards taken care of. Got any sevens? Nope. Go fish. Got any eights? Not a one, sir. Go fish. Got any queens? Got any nines? No. Got any queens? Go fish. <laughs> Come on, dude. Got any eights? No, sir. Go fish. Got any sevens? Nice try. Take my queens back. Go fish. Got any queens? Game is for children. It's also extremely Got hard. Got any eights? Fuck you. This suits me just fine. Got any queens? Can't. I have to ask anyway. Got any nines? Ah, how delightful. That gives me a soup, sir. Got any seven? Go fish. Got any queens? A card. Thank you so much. I've always been lucky when it comes to go fish. A draw. It looks like neither one of us wins this round. What do you mean it's a draw? Round, there were more cards. Oh yes. Got any? Yeah, queens? this is the hardest game I've ever played. Go fish. I need to take a card from the deck first. Got any kings? Got any aces? Go fish, sir. Got any nines? Got any twos? What a fun yeah. game this is. There's 13 Got cases? He doesn't fives? know that. What a fun game this is. What a fun game Got when I start winning. Eights? Go fish, Mr. Fox. Got any sevens? Nice try. Got any kings? Thank I'll just you. take those off your hands. Got any sixes? What a fun game this Fuck is. Fuck you. Got any nines? No, sir. Go fish. Got any fours? Nope. Go f Fuck yourself. Got any sevens? Got any eights? Not a one, sir. Got any jacks? Go fish. Got any twos? <laughs> I just don't know what to ask for. I got too much. Got any aces? Got any fours? Nope. Got any sixes? Thank you. Got any twos? No, sir. Got any jacks? Got any threes? Not a... Hey? That's one set of cards taken care of. Got any eights? Take it. I don't want it. Got any aces? I... Got any Five. fives? Go. Got any queens? Bruh, he's gonna ask for jacks now. Got any eights? Nice try. Got any jacks? What a fun game this is. Got any kings? <laughs> hmm, got any tens? Nice nope. try. Ah, how did I? Got any? Go fish. Got any sevens? Go fish. Got any fives? Oh my god. I just asked you for fives, dude. Can't. I'm good. Hmm, got any tens? Go fish. Ah, got any fours? Chance to come on. Hmm, got any tens? Nope. Go fish. Got any twos? Not a one, sir. Go fish. This is so I've unfair. Been lucky when it comes to go fish. Got any sevens? I love this game. 
Got any nines? <laughs> Go. Got any aces? Nice try. In my queen's Got bag. any queens? I've always been lucky when it comes to go fish. You must have been quite proud to win a lucky charm like that. The charm is nothing, sir. <laughs> you should see what I once won in a challenging game of solitaire. Got any kings? Go fish, mister. Hmm. Got any tens? Go f Nope. Take my aces Got back. Got any aces? I'm sending him to the shadow realm. I'll just take those off your hands. He's going. This suits me just fine. Got any twos? No, sir. I love this game. Got Go into the shadow realm. You take it. I don't want it. Got any eights? I thought you said you were good at this game. You Go help your fish. opponent more? Yeah. No, it sucks. Got any jacks? That's one set of cards taken care of. Got any twos? Go fish, sir. Got any threes? Nope. Got any eights? I'll just take those off your hands. Got any kings? Not a one. This suits me just, just one with that. Got any twos? Just ask him for twos. My match made in heaven, sir. Got any threes? Nice try. Ah, how delightful. Got any fours? Nice no. try. <laughs> Got any? Of course, of course you that's don't have one set. I win. <clears throat> oh, that's right. You never lose. There's a first time for everything, Mr. Big Pig. Why don't him we once? really raise the stakes on this game? Now I can unfortunately get the trinket. Well, sir, if you insist. Which sucks that you have to beat him twice. Got any queens? Got any nines? What a fun game this is. Got any fives? Go fish, sir. Got any aces? Nope. Got any threes? <laughs> Go fish. Where are the dark energy discs? They're there. Got any jacks? Got any twos? Go fish. Got any eights? Nice. Tr Got any sixes? Not a one. Right? Got any fours? Got any sevens? A card. Mm. Thank you. Got any threes? Go fish. All right. Eight. Got any aces? Nice. Tr Got any nines? Go fish. Hey, eat. Mm, got any? For gaming. Ten. Go fish. Yeah, they make you do it twice. Got any twos? You can't play for the trinket until you win once. Got any sixes? I was gonna ask for aces. Got any fours? Nice. Tr got any aces? I did, but apparently it didn't let me, so... Like, I did leave the table, but I guess it didn't count? Got any sevens? <laughs> Goof. Got any eights? Fucking kill. Oh my god. And that make... Got any Hammer. jacks? Nope. Go fish. I left the table in frustration. I was like, fuck this. But it didn't let me. Got any threes? Go fish, sir. Got any kings? Dude. Hmm. Got He's any scamming me. Tens? Go fish. Got any sevens? Not a one. Got any twos? Hmm. Got any tens? No. Got any jacks? Thank you. I love this game. Got any nines? Go fish. Got any queens? Got any kings? Just took mine. Got any Give me M's. Got any aces? No. Nope. Hey? Got any sevens?
Oh, they asked for that too. Twos. Nice. Got any fives? Hey. <laughs> okay. Got any aces? Bruh, how is he using his fucking Millennium yeah, Eye on me? Good. Got any sevens? Go fish. Got any threes? Go fish. I've always been lucky when it comes to go fish. That's such a game artist. Fours? I thought. Got any nines? Go fish. Got any five? God. Got any seven? Nope. Got any kings? Got any fours? Nice try. God damn it. I must apologize, sir. I am rather good at this game. <laughs> Got any twos? Go fish. <laughs> I hope you are not easily discouraged, sir. Our I can't win. We'll place your trinkets on the table and we'll get started. Try this again. Got any sevens? Go fish, Mr. Fox. I need to take a card from the deck. Got it. I don't know what he ace, Got whatever. Five. Got nice try. Got any jacks? Not a one, sir. Got any eights? Got any nines? Nice. Yeah, would you watch a uh, go, go fish, fish anime? Got any tens? I think there, there, there's potential there for something good. Got any sixes? Go fish, sir. Got any kings? I thought you said you were good at. Got any sevens? No, sir. Got any twos? Nope. Got any. Thank you. Got any tens? <laughs> Go fish. It'd be like the Uno anime? It would. Got any threes? Go fish. Ah. Got any queens? Go fish. Nope. Got any eights? Thank you. This suits me just fine. Got any nines? Focused on the characters. Now, Go Fish is part of it. Got any sixes? Not a one, sir. Go Fish. It seems like something they'd play in the, uh, the, uh, with the gambling anime, Keijo. Got any twos? Bro. Got any fours? Nice try. Got any jacks? No. Got any fives? Nope. Get out of here. Got any queens? Got any sixes? What a you... fun game this is. It's only fun Got when you're winning. Got any nines? Go. Got any threes? Nice try. Got any kings? No, sir. Hey, we don't know what he has. Got any sixes? Got any aces? Go fit. Got any nines? <laughs> I've always been lucky when it comes to go fish. Hell yeah, gamers. That's one set of cards taken care of. Got any queens? Go. I wish I had the Millennium Puzzle. Got any fives? Nice. Got any fours? Me. Got any sevens? Go fish, sir. Okay. Got any. Sixes. Got any jacks? Got any kings? Just about to ask for I that too. Apologize. Got any threes? Nice try. My match made in heaven, sir. Got any queens? <laughs> Got any aces? I thought. Got any tens? I've always been lucky when it comes to go fish. Okay. I love in. this game. Got any jacks? Not a one. Okay. Got any fours? I was about to ask for that too. A set, sir. Got any twos? Just about to ask for a two. Oh, God, he's such a cheater. <laughs> I hope you are not easily discouraged, sir. Got any fives? Nope. Go. 
Got any sevens? A the scale? Five. Probably Thank the scale. You so much. I don't even remember what the scale does. Got any jacks? Go fish. I love this game. Got any aces? Go. F Got any queens? Go fish. Got any jacks? Got any threes? No. Ah, that. Got any jacks? Nope. I can't Got have any. a jack. That's Sweet. one set of cards taken care of. Got any queens? I love this game. I win. Fuck you. We did it. We can play the game. Right. So, you won the captain's lucky charm back. Ask yourself, sir. If the charm is so lucky, why did I lose it? Because I'm a superior Go Fish player. That's why. <laughs> yes, I like you, sir. Whenever you want to play Go Fish again with a Go Fish playing pig, I'm ready and waiting. Wild that he just said fucking skill issue and done. Dan Freeze in this chat. Captain Drydock. I just had an I will never fake go fish go again. Fish yeah, no, fuck go fish. All my homies hate go fish. And you'll never guess what happened. He cheated and ended up winning your lucky charm. No, actually, he lost and I won this. <laughs> my lucky charm. You found it. Yes. Do you know what this means? I can go out on the sea again. The curse is lifted. Thank you. I think this is the worst of the Spy Fox Thank games. You, you gotta do the first Sean, one. First. I'm sure. Listen, uh, matey. If you ever need to use the SS Winterprise, just let me know. Enterprise. I'll take you anywhere you need to go. Spy Fox, don't forget. Anytime you need a boat ride, just let me know. Thanks, Captain. You'll be the first to row. Can't resist the call of the sea, can ya? Even when it calls, collect. Let me grab my map and you can show me where you'd like to go. I don't think I have any coordinates yet, do I? Let's do it. I'll just keep the map here in case we need it later. I can only think here's where I keep my sp I don't put that back that's the x-ray gum all this I can't believe how, how long did that take for me to win Without that key, I won't be able to disarm the milky weapon of destruction. His ticker looks like it needs winding. It looks like I need to find that key. Look at this pen. He must have been trying to write a letter from his heart. I think I... Now, what is this? That's the cheese take, and safety Take the cracker. cheese back. Mobile command center. Please stand by. Hi, Spy Fox. Any news? Nothing to report yet. This island sure has a lot of lively characters on it. Everyone's so animated. Hmm. Some people why. say Spy oh, Fox 3 is the way, worst. Uh, well, they're allowed to be wrong. Uh, Harry suggested that uh, you it doesn't have go fish that takes like two hours. Feels like two hours. I swear it felt like it took longer to do that than it did to Dora. Pardon me, sir, but just where do you think you're going? On board? Sir, you are obviously making a little joke. No one but no one is allowed to go on board the SS Deadweight without a gold-edged, wax-sealed, expensively embossed, handwritten invitation. And do you have one of these, sir? Not as such. Then I'm afraid, sir, that you should make like a plane in the Bermuda Triangle and get lost. I Ouch. can gather information about the deck party with this. That was pretty mean. Uh, 
I noticed that there was a party going on down on that big ship at the dock. But I understand you can only go if you were invited. That is true. In fact, I am going as soon as I get All right, Mooch. Door. Oh, so you got an invitation. Taking your stuff. I certainly did. It is really a fancy schmancy one, too. Would you like to look at it? Why, yes. I would love to look at it. My life needs a little direction right now. I think I'll buy that steering wheel. Let hey, Mooch, can you give me that wheel? That up for you. Stupid move. <laughs> Get wrecked, bunny. Oh, forget it. Oh, I almost forgot. This is not just the local trinket emporium. It is also this island's maritime museum, and I'm not allowed to let anyone touch the exhibits. I can't believe Moosh would fall for such an obvious trick. One of the classic blunders. Not you again! How many times do I have to tell you? This is a private party, and without an invitation, you are not allowed to go on board. Sheesh! The nerve of some people. You'd think they would. Yay! Let me see that. Signed, Russian Blue. Russian Blue is the funniest joke that I didn't get. Oh, as a sir. We are ever so honored to have you on board with us today. Please, feel free to come and go as you wish. Why, thank you. How gracious of you. What a weasel. I trust you will have an enjoyable visit. And if there is any way in which I can kiss up some more, sir, I trust you will let me know. But of course. Have they let Spy Fox on the boat and he doesn't even wear shoes? So, this is the deck party. Before I join the festivities, I should let Monkey Penny know I'm here. Spy Fox to Mobile Command Center. Please stand by. Stand by. Hi, Hello, Spy Mario. Fox. How's the mission progressing? I just made it onto the SS Deadweight. I'm going to take a look around. Good. Keep your eyes peeled for clues as to where William the Kid's secret fortress is. I the have Kid's been revived. So secret. I you just simply go fish for like spies, hours. Fox. It's oh, our job to know. And we are good <laughs> at our jobs. Spy Fox out. Who the heck is this on the watch? I have Monkey to say, Penny. you certainly have a unique conducting style. Thank you, sir. I it see. runs in my family. My father was a train conductor. Now, if you don't mind, I'm a very busy. Joke. I'm just gonna be fishing in Yakuza 3. Yeah. I don't think I fished for that. I think I just bought it. Fuck that. I, you already know the side quest I'm trying. Yep. Gotta get the tuna. Yep. Like, I was just doing it at first because I'm like, oh, I'm sure, like, uh, fishing, whatever. Now that's a and then it's like, oh, you either pay 300,000 yen, which I'm like, oh, you fucking dick. Yeah, it's bad. Or you just fish for a it. A frog suit like this might come in handy. Especially frog suit is the so clever. Dairy crisis at hand. Oh, look, I got the trophy for picking up five pieces of trash on the beach. That's good. <laughs> I love that you can just press these over and over again. This this is the best part of these games, right? Just clicking wherever and usually getting some kind of reaction out of it. Yeah, they don't need to do it, but I love it. It is extra, but like the good way. Pardon me, I'm looking for the restroom. This is the bridge, the head's down below. Actually, I need to go pretty bad too. But of course, I'm not allowed to leave my post. The shift's over at two frog ribbits and a cork pop. Then my replacement shows up. Oh, well, hang on tight. I'm sure your relief will come soon. One two way frog or ribbits another. and a cork pop, you said. I can get... I wonder what this gadget does. It looks like something Quack would come up with. It says, Timekeeper, July 3rd. It's getting so noisy in here that I'm beginning to get the urge to kill some time. Art. I love fart jokes. Hello, you must be... Russian Blue. 
Get it? I didn't know Russian Blue was a cat when I played this as a kid. Like, I knew she's a cat, but I didn't know it was like a breed of cat. I just thought it was that the joke was that she's blue and Russian, but no. How much art do you think exists of Russian Blue? Of course I'm a nuisance. I'm a shrewd business female. Let's just say my business is international a lot. trade. Okay, but you've stirred my curiosity. How much what E621 sort of art does, does she the have? SS Deadweight carry? That's for me to know, Mr. Do you want an actual As answer to that question? Probably like a page. A luxury liner. Let me luxury. Hi, Grom. Sure, Jim, you <laughs> hey, what's up? I understand. You just missed me play Go Fish for a long time. I can gather information about Russian Blue with this. There's a few. What do you mean? There's a few here and there. Here's where my notes. Yeah, it wrecked me. What's with that guy on the bridge? Why I'm guessing so there's. About guarding the SS Deadway. She's a very sparse Maybe candidate for art. That I am an international business feline. Yeah, it's my way too hard. Are not always made, shall we say, in a single location. I see. The SS Deadweight makes clandestine journeys from the island. Very interesting. I never said that, regardless of whether or not it's true. What's with that sailor on the bridge? Why is he so serious about guarding the SS Deadweight? He's a strange lad, all right. He only seems to care about making it to happy hour on time. He makes me nervous. Why is that? I thought he was going to bite my head off once when I tried to look at the maps on the bridge. It's top secret stuff, you know. Thank you, dog. What a good dog. I haven't heard well, so many interesting I can at least say it's not of the character, but Russian Blue will get you get you some hits. Of course it will. This must be an audio alarm clock. I wonder if there's a snooze button. July, July. Give me a moment. I, I'm now I gotta go get my dog who's now starting to make noise. Okay. What do you know about the sailor up on the SS Deadweight Bridge? All I know is that he dashes off the ship as soon as his ship ends. I've heard him muttering about happy hour. Happy hour at the cantina, no doubt. The two, so nine. What is this? A sound effects convention? <laughs> it's getting so noisy in here that I'm beginning to get the urge to kill some time. <laughs> I'd hate to see the wristwatch version. Try that. <laughs> I haven't heard so many. I just want to check something. So, your shift ends at two frog ribbits and a cork pop? That's kind of an odd signal, isn't it? You know how this fancy modern technology works. They like to keep us peons in the dark. Frog ribbits. Is this clock? I haven't heard... There, are you happy now? You're not in the kennel anymore. You're on my lap. I'd hate to see the She just licks her paws. Just look it away. Classic dog. This must doing dog things. It's and acting like the most spoiled little brat. It certainly it is interesting trying to solve this. A sound effect. It's certainly. What is it? Come on. 
It's getting so Is this cold? I'd hate to see the This must I haven't heard But 19. What? No. Is this clock? I haven't heard. This must. What? What is the timing they want on this? What is? I'm trying to find the frog sounds. I'd hate to. See. It's getting. I'm just not even getting the frog sound. What is this? A... It oh, says damn it. timekeeper. What's up? Uh, I, my line broke. The fishing game in this one's like I understand Pretty it. Bad, but yeah. It says yeah. happy hour, twelve. Way more complicated two. than I feel like it needs to be. Especially when like all the fucking fi far out fish will take like probably what do you ten know minutes. About this sailor from the SS Deadweight. Oh, that Sal Probably even longer than that just because of how the more. fishing works. What time is that? He shows up here 19 minutes after the start of happy hour. There we go. Okay. Interesting. 1219. <laughs> That's it. That's the sound the sailor told me indicates the end of his shift. I was looking for like the frog sound, but I, I just couldn't find it. Didn't you hear the clock? What are you still doing here? I know. I heard it. I could leave now if only my replacement was here. Unless you're the guy. Uh, yes. As a matter of fact, I am your replacement. Consider yourself replaced. How can you be my relief if you're not wearing a sailor hat? Right. What was I thinking? Oh, well, it's a good thing I have one. It does look pretty good in a sailor hat, I gotta say. Okay, you can go now. Thank you. Out of my way. Coming through. I love the way he waddles away. You gotta go. You gotta waddle, go. Waddle, waddle. What? What? What's wrong with that? Any grapes? Hey, hi, Digi. What's up? Hello. The, the CD ROM is stuck in your iMac. What? That's curious. The SS Deadweight made an unscheduled stop out in the middle of the ocean. This particular spot could require some further investigation. Let's see. It looks like the SS Deadweight went to 15 degrees latitude, 155 degrees longitude, 15 degrees latitude. Hope you're doing well, Digi. <laughs> Digi, what have you been streaming? Hmm, it sounds just like a seashell out here. Hmm, this looks interesting. Babe, go by the lemonade. <laughs> Let's do it. Interesting, a pool of white water. I've never seen white water like this before. I'll, I'll, I'll spoil it for you. Well, not the milk, but uh, it might not be milk. It, it might be the fanboy milk. You, you don't want to drink the fanboy milk. Wait a minute. No, it's stay away from the fanboy milk. milk. Like, you don't want to drink the fanboy milk. I might add. No. I need to find the source of this milk, but I can't. I hear they have a stall phone in their cover. Now no. I'm a lean green swimming machine. You can't tell me what not to do. You're not my mom. You're right. I'm your. I'm your dad. I thought you were her daddy. Wait, wait. Where are you going, Spy Fox? No, you're supposed to go diving. 
This looks good. Let's try here. Dog. I'll keep my extraordinarily sharp eyes open for clues, so I can find Kid's secret fortress. There we go. Ah, uh, yes, the underwater splendor of the Mediterranean. Listen, Dwayne, when was the last time you did your homework? You can drink the, the fanboy milk only if you've done your homework. The rules. Aha! That pipe must be where all the milk is coming from. What a terrible waste. I have to put a stop to this. I wonder if this pool of milk attracts catfish. Good joke. Wouldn't you know it? Two nog dogs on me looking robotic. Nog dogs. Fish. That's homework, and I caught up on hours today. So nine hours ago. All right, fine. You can you can get one sippy. Only one. I'm on you. You're trespassing in private waters. You're mine, intruder. Guess again, Tin Tuna. <laughs> Here's where I... No, actually, before we go back down there, let's go get a gadget, just in case. Okay. Darn. Thanks for letting me leave my frog suit on your boat, Captain Drydock. Just let's get the quarter, just in case. I feel That's like we're gonna need it. Spy trapped. That's rad. That is rad. Would you do you play Spy Fox if he got like heat actions, like he just throws a quarter and it just bounces on everyone really hard? You know, that actually pretty amazing, actually. That would be. Little do these guards know that underneath this cool green exterior hides the highly skilled super secret agent, Spy Fox. I've got to find a way to get past these metallic macos. Have a gadget for this? That's not going to do me any good. Someone once said, the secret to life is making good decisions, which come from good judgment. I don't think I can just swim by those metallic mackerel. Please stand by. They say. Hi, Spy Fox. Have you found William the Kid's secret fortress yet? Not yet. Have you been able to find any more clues on the Spy Corps computer? Not yet. Let's keep snooping around. I'm sure we'll find something. So, DG, why, why is it stuck in there? Are you able to get it out? How about if... I guess Russian Blue is not important in this. Interesting. Because it is, it is completely random what you get. Hello, I want to compliment you on your band. You sure know how to liven up a party. You play with such a passionato. Thank you, sir. It's always nice when one of the guests is a fellow music lover. I hope you will enjoy the party. Here's where I keep my spy gadget. Hmm. Okay, did I skip a step? Tell me, what's the difference between a souvenir and a trinket? Souvenir is a French word meaning 
to remember. Trinket is a Middle English word which means small shoemaker's knife. I hope that clears it up for you, sir. I don't know if that's true, I but I'd like to believe myself, it is. If I were an evil, twisted, misguided, egotistical supervillain, where would I put my secret fortress? Here's a number that goes out to all you white tux wearing spies. Here's a number. It says entertainment. I also gotta say the Okinawa map is a lot Honey, smaller than I expected. Oh, I love it. Tangled, it's no longer entertainment. This still doesn't go anywhere. I guess maybe this, this is just locked in this playthrough. I'm trying to remember what it was. That oh, was this. What do you mean, Rip? I guess worms have a bit of frogophobia. Oh well, a fishing line like this could come in handy. I can't go now. It looks like the other guard is coming back. I should wait until the guard can't see me. I should wait until the guard can't see me. I can't go now. It looks like the other guard is coming back. I should wait until the guard can't see me. I should wait until the guard can't see me. You mean he can't see you? I can't go now. It looks like the other guard is coming back. Come back? What do you mean come back? What do you mean come back? What do you mean? I can't go now. It looks like the other guard is coming back. What, what do you mean, come back? Oh, because we're dropping frames. These worms are definitely frogophobic. I can't go now. It looks like the other guard is coming back. I should wait until the guard can't see me. I should wait until the guard can't see me. I should wait until the guard can't see me. Hopefully it smooths out. I can't go now. It looks like the other guard is coming back. It says we're still going. I should wait until the guard can't see me. I can't just swim past these guards. They seem to dislike spies in cool green frog suits. I should wait until the guard can't see me. Hmm. People to go into my chat. People to go into my chat. I think the Twitch servers shat themselves. I can't go now. It looks like the other guard is coming back. I should wait until the guard can't see me. We back? Okay. Yeah, yeah it was the Twitch server. We didn't now. lose internet. It looks like the other guard is coming back. Hi, what's up? Hey, gamers. I should wait until the guard can't see me. Gotta wait until the guard can't see me. I should wait until the guard can't see me. I should wait until the guard can't see me. I ask myself, I should wait until the guard can't see me. I can't go now. It looks like the other guard is coming back. What, what is the timing on this? There we go. I just had to change the screen. Here goes. It's the dreaded Rear Admiral, also known as Spy Maneuver Number 41. Oh. 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 Green was dead. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, that it seems like the server has died. Wasn't much I could do about this that. Be a popular fishing spot. I should wait until the guard can't see me. You just let me click on a game. It's not. It's not going to be any challenging. 
I hate to be the bearer of an underwater wedgie, but I've run out of options. Excuse me. I'm sorry. Oh, Who said excuse God. me? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Fisherman said excuse me? Yeah. Uh, I learned that one. It's sometimes the servers just die and it's not my fault because I was seeing people go like rip and I was like, what do you mean rip? So, I, don't, I don't think we got DC'd. The quality might be poopa stinka, but I mean, it happens. A box of old airplane fuses. I'd hate to refuse a find like this. The seat's missing. Maybe the pilot used it as a flotation device. Here's the jet's fuse panel. I wonder what this fuse panel is for. These jet fuse panels sure look complicated. I once sat on a panel of fuses at an electronics conference. What a dim discussion that was. These jet... I wonder what this fuse... Hey, I once sat on a panel of fuses at an electronics... Here's where I keep my spy gadgets. That's not going to do me any good. They want me to actually this use it. looks like the missile fire button. Now I can do some damage to that door. Something seems. It was on the me. not like this screen. Yeah, there's not much I can do about I that. Sat on a I wonder what I'm going to come back. If the, if the servers just die, they die. That's how it goes. Uh oh, this steel door looks pretty thick, and I already used my laser toothbrush. I'll have to find another way in. And that must be embarrassing if you. Firefox, and uh, you can only one gadget. Seems to be skipping. I I These can't do much. These jet fuse panels sure look complicated. These jet fuse. I wonder what this fuse panel is for. Trying to move it, game. I once sat on a panel of fuses. That I wonder what this fuse panel is for. Does not want me to move these. I'm gonna use this. That's why. fuses must fit into the pen. I wonder if this fuse panel is familiar to this. It is. It, it could have been worse. Uh, I could have had to redo all of the uh, go fish. Wait, worse than death. This'll teach him for not leaving a key under the welcome mat. I guess that guided missile was misguided. Of course, I planned that. I love a dramatic pause before blowing up giant steel doors leading to secret fortresses. The shrimp! That's the guy who fried the rice! I think I've discovered the entrance to William the Kid's secret fortress. Spy Fox to Mobile Command Center. Please stand by. Hello, monkey. What's up? Spy Fox, if I've told you once, I've told you a million times. It's Monkey Penny. Sorry. What do you want? I'm busy saving the world right now. Our informant, Mata Harry, has some important information for you. Where can I find Mata Harry? I'm not sure. All she said is that she's underwater and you'll treasure her disguise. Okay, I'll check it out. Spy Fox out. Okay. Hey. Hey there. The boat will sink at midnight. It looks like it already sunk to me. That's not the correct code phrase. I know, but it's the truth. Agent Fox, it's good to be working with you again. Hi, Giraffe. Mata Harry, what a fortunate surprise. What invaluable information nugget do you have for me? 
That has it stabilized? I this nectar of the goat thing, but I don't know what it is. It looks like it fits into some larger component. Can you use it? Are you kidding? I'll treasure this. Hopefully everything's stabilized. Now I gotta go. Good fishing, Agent Fox. Thanks for always sticking your neck out for me, Mata. You're a gem. Stable? Thank you. God, I can imagine speedrunning this game chat is a nightmare because of all the uh, the goat fish you have to do. Welcome to William the Kid's secret volcano fortress. Secret Please volcano insert fortress. Insert the electronic code box and answer today's passcode phrase. Hmm. The spy wanted to counter the remark with intelligence. That is not a valid response. Have a nice day. Answering that code phrase looks like it might end up being punishing. Punishing. Welcome to Will. It looks like the electronic code box plugs into the panel of this voice-activated security system. Welcome to William the Kid's secret volcano fortress. The doctor is losing her patience. This is correct. You may now enter July 3rd Sunday. At will. Not actually the day of today. Even better July 21st. Thank you. What a polite On a Sunday. Box. But the game wanted that. I'd better let Monkey Penny know I made it inside Kid's Secret Fortress. Spy Fox to Mobile Command Center. Please stand by. Spy Fox, I'm glad you checked in. How's it going? Smooth. As smooth as sandpaper underpants. I Ew. just got into Kid's Oh, Secret I wouldn't Fortress. wear that. Excellent. Now you've got paper to disarm me. that milky weapon of destruction. I'm in there like swimwear. Spy Fox, out. That is an awful thing to think about. What did they walk into? Hi, Sparky. Uh, to answer your question that I saw on Blue Sky when I went live, like uh, sort of the answer is, uh, how do you get out? The answer is, uh, never. I wonder what this diagram is for. It looks strangely significant. A yellow jumpsuit. I'll bet this is the official Nectar of the Goats uniform. No one would recognize me in one of these. Yeah, well, welcome to the club. It's you and me, nobody else. It's a very exclusive club at the moment. Mostly because there's no other people. I've never club, liked member the word of one. Esper. It's, it's a secret passageway. Oh yeah, I remember now. This is the place that it the, with the locked door. Grand. What a clever secret entrance. William the Kid can go to crimes the town now? square oh, he's to his crimes. secret you fortress me? anytime he wants. Be gay, do crimes, kill your heroes. Grande Fromaggio. All right. Italian for the big cheese. How Imagine dope. having a government assigned for Sona. I mean, you're a Sonic fan. You already have one. Yeah. Boon me, but I'm right. I'd better leave this door unlocked in case I need to get back in here later. I, I sure am. Yeah. Damn it, chat. This is your fault. It is. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know what it is, but yeah, it's probably your fault. I can't really blame Boots anymore. Trey's Trey's done. Yeah, fuck you, chat. I looked, I looked away to see, it, see what was being said, and unfortunately I got one of those fight starts in Yakuza 3 where you have to, like, hit a button. That thing God, I hate those. Giving me the My favorite thing in that game is the, um... Perhaps if I was wearing some kind of uniform, I could get by. That where you learn a new move and something really stupid happens that inspires Kiryu. Those are the best. Yeah, I just got, like, the one with the, the first one with the granny. My favorite move is probably the, uh... I better hide. The lady passing out the flyers. Uh, 
Like, I'm just trying to go back to Kamurocho, but things keep, like, popping up. So that's the dastardly oh, William oh, the course, Kid that everyone's so worked up key. about. Russian Blue, take this key wallet and put remember, it back where it belongs. Don't, don't fuck with us Yakuza fans. It contains the Russian Blue key. key. The only that too. thing that can stop my milky weapon of destruction. Right away, your imperial. Never to this day, I still don't know what the fuck I'm doing with in your bank account. Nobody knows what Majong is. For all your help. It's a pleasure doing business with you. Call all I, all me All I can figure out it's like it's like poker with tiles. That's about it. Yeah, it is. You just want pairs. I need to get my hands on that key. He also, mentioned. thirteen orphans is the best hand, and you're never getting it. <laughs> This looks exactly like that diagram over in the locker room. Now I need to move these levers to the positions shown in the diagram. You see, this is what exactly what I always talk about with Yakuza 3. People are so bad at Yakuza 3 that they're like, oh my god, baby rage, the enemies are so bad. Bro, you just gotta whiff the first hit. This you either whiff the first William hit, the and you just start uh, using a strong attack, or you just grab them. It's so easy to get past their defenses. I did a whole stream of that game easily, and people were complaining the entire time, and I'm just like, it's so easy to get by. Good to hear from you. What's up? Honestly, it's, the, it's not the mooks I'm having trouble with. It's just bosses. I like the bosses in the game. Uh, if you want to get into Mahjong, but you have zero memory, play uh, Mahjong Soul. It's free to play, Novus. That shouldn't be you just sign up, you play Mahjong, and it handles all the hard parts. Same with Yakuza. It's the Yakuza Remastered Collection, so it's the PS4, but I'm playing it on I PS5, because it can play PS4 games. Panel in order to disarm Kid's Milky Weapon of Destruction. And I think just at most, all, all it has is just an up updated localization. I believe it. Genuinely, I, I don't understand why people are... Like, it's it's a thing with the community that they, they just do not understand how to get around the, the guards. It's so easy to get past them. This must them. be some sort of tram to take people around in Kid's Fortress. Not even a quarter, it's a nickel. There's one sound the ear can hear better than any other. The sound of falling money. They should get a tickle from this nickel. A tickle nickel. Oh, this dumbass kid. Some folks don't have the patience to figure that out. You, you mean pressing the grab button? A button that takes seconds? It is starting to feel like the grab is pretty, pretty useful. It, it is extremely people. useful in that game. That's why I'm like, I don't know. I think people just played that game wrong. Because is an enemy down? Just grab them. You will yeah, immediately pick them up, them. and they will literally be yeah. Grabs stunned, are really good, and you can beat them up some more. Rip. Hey, what happened? We're trapped. He tricked us. This isn't good at all. Let us down from here. No. Sorry, folks. I'm on a mission. Listen, buddy. I'm starting to get a cramp. Couldn't you just listen seriously? You've got to let us go. I just know our supervisor is going to bring this up in our annual review. Ooh, I'm afraid we'll be hanging out real. there for a while. And my supervisor's gonna bring stuff out of review. Please let me go. Oh, this must be Kid's secret volcano office. I should take a look around. Nope, nope, nope. I'm not coming out. Oh, no, 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 no. What the hell? I'm not coming out. Oh, okay. But if you look, I'm gonna go away. Hi there. Oh, he saw me.
You chat, look, it's it's you. Oh no way, that's that's you. There you are, look. Oh my god, that's so cool. You're in this game. That's you. I always knew it. How many people in chat have confessed having a crush on Spyfuck? None, but you could be the first person. Oh my god, that's great. It stays there. Oh, that's so good. The key I need is protected by these dangerous lasers. Let's see. The red laser connects with the red socket, and the blue laser connects to the blue socket. I wonder if moving these mirrors will redirect the lasers. I've got to get that key for the control panel. I haven't seen so many lasers since I went to that show at the planetarium. I haven't seen so many lasers since I went to that room? show at the planetarium. These laser beams are cutting into my time. Whoops. That blue laser is giving me the blues. I'd happily... Whoops. Both lasers are wrong now. Hey. Whoops. If I don't redirect that blue laser, I'll never get my hands on that key. If I can't you, get that, you can probably squeeze your hand in there and get that realistically. This isn't very well guarded. Whoops! Kind of a rookie mistake. That blue state. laser is giving me the blue. I happily. That blue laser. If I. Both lasers are wrong. That blue laser. As long as. Both lasers are wrong. Whoops! I don't know. It's easier. Whoops. That blue I have That blue as long The red laser isn't right. I mean the red laser oh it has to go to a red one. The red laser isn't right. If I don't redirect that blue laser, I'll never get my hands on that key. Yeah, okay, I see the arrows now. I thought it was just colors going in one direction, or like both directions. Whoops. What? Why would you reset it? Ooh. If I don't, if I can The red That blue, as long as That blue laser. That blue laser is giving me the blues. Whoops. What? Why did it... Okay, what the fuck is that? Whoops. It's changing the path of the laser? It's so weird, what? Yeah, do you, you seen this shit? The blue laser isn't right. If I don't redirect that blue laser, if I can't get that... Both lasers are wrong. I'm not talking about reflecting it in itself. Uh, the way I had it, it was like, wait, hold on. You're not, you're not putting it in the right... Like, the laser direction changed, and I was like, wait, that's right. That's going in the right path. The blue laser is... If I don't redirect that blue... No. The blue laser is still passing over the key. Try this. That did the trick. Yeah. Now I can grab the key wallet. That's what I was trying to do and the game was like, it, the I order I was doing it I was not right. Key. Now I just need to use it in the control panel to be Milky Weapon of Destruction. Listen, I've seen Totally Spies. Are you going to tell me Totally Spies says it wrong? 
They're both spies. Yeah, have you seen the laser gif? Hot butter. There's kids' giant milk carton. The sight of kids' diabolical milk carton curdles my stomach. He Oh, milk? It looks like a billboard. Do they even still make got milk games? I why there's a billboard in the middle of a secret fortress. I haven't seen one in a while. They probably don't. Yeah, t t uh, now, Totally Spies was uh, the writer's poorly disguised fetish. I hope this is the right key. Uh oh. For which key? I think I'll try another. I have to go I all the way back, and that's right not worth key. it. Uh oh. It looks like I got the wrong key. I like how there's there's no alarm system if you get the wrong key. It's just like, well, well one of right. these. I hope this is the right key. Yeah, there's so many episodes of Totally Spies when you realize it's someone's fetish, you're just like, I understand now. That is a trick. Once again, I've saved the world from a horrible or in this case, smelly fate. Now I need to go get that goat. Not so fast, my That doesn't look like milk. Femboy milk. You may think you have outfoxed me by disarming my milky weapon of destruction, but I'm afraid it's too late to save your precious cows. It's over, Billy. Give the moms. yourself up. Don't or there's ever something. call me Billy. It's William. And it's not over yet, my foxy nemesis. When I pull this lovely lever, the cow stables will become completely flooded with milk. And that will be the end of the dairy world as we know. Sorry, Jumny, if I do this, if I if I do this wrong, that's it. No more milk for you, Jumny. You'll, ha you'll have to be flat for the rest. That's the most despicable thing I've ever time, seen. that is. <laughs> hey, Darcy, what's up? <coughs> Man, Hope you're doing well. This is really rich. Kid, you're kidding yourself if you think I'm going to let you get away with this. It's too late. And now, if you'll excuse me, Mr. Fox, I have a flight to catch on my giant metallic getaway blimp. Where I will implement my plan to take over the world, filling it with my delicious goat byproducts. Delicious? You must be insane. So do you do you think insane? they milk uh, William the You're kid here? The crazy one. If you think you can save the cow, who, who do you think is the goat that's getting milked? Adios, Mr. Fox, and good luck finding this secret passageway to the stables. You'll need it. Stupid door. Thanks for leaving a little clue, kid. Now all I have to do is find that ascot. Well, yo, that's Fred Jones's ascot. I've been itching to take this jumpsuit off. I think whomever this belonged to had fleas. I don't remember I guess... where Oh yeah, no, it's his office stuff. Uh... Is that you think it is?
go. Oh yeah, there it was. Okay. That's Kid's ascot. This must be the secret passageway to the stables where Kid is holding the cows. I'd better hurry. Gotta save the cows. <laughs> Is one big chicken. Hello there, puny puppy like creature. You are probably intimidated by my rippling muscles. Do you happen to know the ways of a cockadoodle foo warrior? Cockadoodle foo, you say? It I sounds do familiar. I can use this to gather information about cockadoodle. I like how funky this guy just is so bad at his job that he's just like, do you know the way of of the cockadoodle flu? And you're just like, no. Oh, that's okay. I won't. I won't hurt you or anything. You know that would that would make too much sense as a henchman. I'm I'm stupid. Gotta love the hench life. Who out there henching? Any any henches in chat? I've made. The chat's filled with nothing but henchmen. Big fan of, uh, what's his name, 21? The best henchman? What did they come to? Do you know anything about Merv a gooner? Well, I, I mean, gooning, gooning is pretty great right now, you know. Uh, Batman's always beating up goons, so like, there's there's a lot of room for new goons. A book? Yeah, you can have it if they're interested. Yeah, there, there's a lot of a uh, lot of villains you can goon for right now. I've moved to a more spiritual phase. Penguin's got a lot. Uh, you can join Poison Ivy, Mr. Freeze. The Riddler. B, you may have just saved the planet from this dairy drought. You're a superstar. The Riddler is great because, like, if you solve the riddle, you could just join his uh, his gang. That's not going to do me any good. Usually. <laughs> That's not going. Do it. All right, my little furball. Now try. I don't think I ever got this scenario. On for size. This cockadoodle foo book from B should help me defeat that funky chicken. Oh, Riddler absolutely has a trivia night. Well, actually, no, he doesn't, because there's a different villain that does that. Is that just Riddler? No, there's a guy. He's in the Batman. That's how I know about him. I forget his name, but uh, he's a he's a big dude who does like quizzes. Quizzler, I want to say his name is not not Riddler. Chaka Doodle Foo looks like a piece of cake. Now that I see the instruction manual, was that? this fancy counter move should work you on said my over-inflated. Yeah, the Batman. Yeah, the Batman. All right, Doodle. I'm going to oh, yeah, was like that, that with the angry that... moth. I know what you're talking about. That show didn't last a whole long because they were trying no, to did. actually like. It did. People hated it because it was. Uh, I mean, it was basically just people thought it was going to be Batman in the animated series again, and it wasn't. It lasted a few seasons. What? What happened? Didn't think I could beat you, huh? Well, I'd stay and uh, toy with you longer. Okay, but no, hold like on. You're thinking of the CG Batman. Batman. Wait a minute. Yeah, I got I got my Batman people. mixed up. Yeah, they canceled no, the Batman show for that, and uh, or not the Batman, um, Brave and the Bold like for that. This. And Brave and the Bold was not very good. Or, not, not Brave and the Bold wasn't very good. The CG one wasn't very good, so it sucks that they canceled it for that. I don't remember the name. All I remember was, like, they were purposely trying to use, like, the BC villains. Yep. Now I've got the you right Batman where had I want probably you. the best design for Mr. Freeze. Round. Come on, I can still take you. Squawk, squawk, squawk. Really, a good a good chunk of the villain designs were actually pretty decent. Yeah, I I can't remember what that guy's name the is. The kidnapped though. dairy cows. I found them. Hang on, everyone. My name is Spy Fox, and I'll rescue you shortly. Continue treading milk, and I'll be right there. 
The whole plot of that episode is the guy lost like a game show quiz. And he's mad, and then he's like sitting in a room with Batman answering quizzes. I hereby declare you a free range cow. And that milk is super contaminated. Like, William the Kid wins anyway. Thank you, one spy fox. But you're wrong. Go ahead, free the cows this time. But I'll be back to milk the world. He's never back. Again. <laughs> he doesn't show up in any of the sequels. <laughs> Not so fast, kid. The last thing the world needs is another escaped ghost. Fast, Fox. This road ends just ahead. I think you can uh, mess this up. This'll eject me right onto Kid's blimp. Yeah, uh, yeah. You're just missing out. Like you can't get the good ending. I believe that was a thing as a kid. I, I didn't get. I didn't think to do that. I'd better check in with Monkey Penny. Spy Fox to Mobile Command Center. Please stand by. Bye, Fox. Have you found William the Kid yet? I'm on his escape blimp now. Professor Quack says he can see you on the radar. Spy Fox, you can't let William the Kid get away. But what about the sequel? There are other supervillains out there. We'll it's true. be fine. That's true. What should I do when I nab him? We've already set up a mobile evil villain jail. Monkey Penny, do you have the coordinates for the That's good they have a mobile villain evil jail? villain jail. Yes. You know, I need more of those. Are 10 degrees south, 20 degrees west. You need to fly the blimp over it. I'll transmit the coordinates to the spy watch in case you need to look at them again. And south, 20 now west. I need to maneuver this ghastly blimp to that location. I'll get that dastardly villain. Yo, free bread? Looks like someone didn't finish their lunch. Well, you never know when you might need a piece of stale rye bread. A rye. An electric screwdriver set. This could come in handy. Yeah, I mean, it's when you might electric screwdriver is pretty good. It's somewhere. no sonic screwdriver, but I mean. In here. This looks like some sort of conveyance between uh, nothing. the front and the back of Kid's blimp. This blimp is so long, I guess they need an easy way to get things between the front and the back. No, the sonic screwdriver is from something else. This reminds me of my high-flying days in the Spy Air Corps. There's nothing to hold on to. That's not going to do me any good. That's not going to do me any good. Got it. going to do me any good. That not work? No. That's not going to do me any good. That's not going to do me any good. Oh, I see what they want. That's not going to do me any good. Wait, what do you mean it's not going to 
That's not going to do me any good. I haven't seen a tube like this since I fought that evil tuba-playing tuna with tuberculosis in Tunisia. Can't, like, scale that? What? There's so many ways for me to go here. Firefox is, uh, being dumb, chat. He, he doesn't want to listen. That looks like the entrance to the front of Kid's overblown blimp. I've got to get over there. I hope this old rust bucket with wings is airworthy. Hey, maybe they want me to use this here, because, like... That's not going to what do you mean that's not going to do you any good? I, I hate That's not when you have a solution for a game and it wants an exact solution and it's like, ah, I'll use this. I really need to get to the blimp's control room. Spy Fox. All two pilots. This must be the control room for kids' diabolical getaway blimp. A navigation panel. Now I can use the coordinates Monkey Penny sent me via the spy watch to maneuver this dastardly contraption over the evil villain jail. Then I can finally put William the Kid where he belongs. N20. Now I just need to find a way to get Kid out of this blimp and into Evil Villain Jail. Aha! The ejection seat controls must be here. I can finally throw Kid into Evil Villain Jail. This is so That's stupid. That's where the ejection seat controls are. I need Coaster. to get inside get it? that. I need a screwdriver to open this panel. Yeah, use... Use the loud electric screwdriver. Oops, that must be the wrong screwdriver head. He talks very loudly about this. Minus, that's what... That did the trick. It's next to gay baby jail, that's correct. Hmm, what an interesting device. It's just like the toaster we have back at Spy Corps gay Cafeteria. Gay baby jail. For idiot babies. Well, a piece of rye bread well, might do the trick. Why is chat in there? They are. Okay, never mind. That's what these streams are. Uh. My trap is set. I'd better hurry. What's going on? Somehow he well, heard none of this. Of course. Sorry, kid. I have a little errand I need to run. Hmm? What? Spy Fox? I'm really getting tired of your meddling in my dairy domination plans. Yes, well, I do have a tendency to show up and ruin evil villains' schemes. I just thought I'd toast your accomplishment before you go. Go? What do you mean by that? This Too is the mobile jail. Only one parachute. Yeah, they, they were not kidding. It's mobile. That looked painful. But also, they erected a fence around it. So what's the point of it being mobile? Serving up his goat byproducts in evil villain jail. From now on, I would have gotten away with my evil plan. for that pesky spy fox. You think Spy Fox is his real name? Spy Fox! The fence is also on wheels. Good for them. You'll pay for this. I'll be back! That's like no half the point of a fence. True. I'm just saying... It seems annoying if you need to instantly move it. Later that day. 
Walter Wireless here with our top story. Spy Fox oh god, who's the president at the time of, the of this game? Near disastrous milk shortage. Today at the Capitol, Clinton? the president Bush? is honoring Spy Fox as the nation's new hero. We now go live to the presidential press room where the ceremony is already in progress. For outstanding heroism and swag and that's Clinton. in the face of utter dairy chaos and for bringing the nefarious William What is the cow version of Clinton? Justice. What do you call this? I award you, Spy Fox, our nation's highest honor. The May cow I version of Clinton? With the big daddy congressional cookie of You get a cookie. That's all you get. You get a cookie. Yeah, sure. That sounds like a routine. Three cheers for Spy Fox. Get one cookie. Full Clinton. Yeah, that's the perfect name. I've got my cookie. Has anyone got milk? I get it. I think that's where we'll call it today, since it's almost midnight. We got two games done. I would have done the other two Spy Fox games, but uh, unfortunately, we spent a lot of time on Go Fish. That better be the best damn cookie in the world. Jumny, if, you, if you're ever in the area, I will make you cookies. I do like baking, even though I never get a chance because Lonely's always the one baking, and she's like, I made banana bread today, which is great. There isn't. I just mean I, I don't get a chance to do sleep. Uh, Agent Redhead, thanks for the raid. We're actually about to end, but uh, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Beat the game. I would have gotten away with my evil plan if it weren't for that pesky spy fox. The aspect ratio changed a tiny bit just for the ending for some reason. I had it set in a certain spot and now it's just like, what? Oh, they're eating crunch berries. I think it, honestly, I think this works as a good spy parody. It's definitely a much better game than Dora that we played earlier. I'll probably separate these for the pod. Oh, yeah. I guess the raid message has to be go fish. We'll come back to two and three at some point. We'll play these. Um, I've, I've been meaning to do a lot of the games. I've never streamed pretty fish games. I have only streamed one of the Putt Putt games, so I'll probably do all the Putt Putts and Ready Fish at some point. I think I might like Pajama Sam, or it's, it's a tough call. I don't know if I like Pajama Sam more than Spy Fox, because like I think I really enjoy the Spy Fox games, minus the Go Fish is so unnecessarily RNG heavy that like, I can't imagine how stressful that must be. That you need to win that once or twice. Ninety-seven. Old. Oh. Oh, I never get to. Oh, that's right. That's crazy. You know what that means? I get to say, hey, chat. Did you know that on Tuesday we're doing an early birthday stream? That's right. That's going to be uh, the first thing on the schedule. I'm probably going to be live all day. We're going to be doing Mario Party on the front page. We'll be doing uh, one board from every Mario Party. And I might do crowd control for three. I would have gotten away with my evil plan. I think that's a good idea. Pesky spy so, it's looking like that'll be the thing. If people want to join me during, uh, they can. I know certain people. Thursday? Big boss, you get to pick the game for a half hour. Friday, probably, is making the level three. I don't know yet. Sunday? I don't know. I haven't really decided. Sundays really depends. Maybe we'll do the rest of the Spy Fox games. But uh, thank you all so much for watching. Go raid someone. Uh, I'm gonna tab out of the game because you gotta play this in a weird way. Oof. All right. 
Uh, let's go raid someone. Clive. That'll be a good one. Uh, we are going to raid Agent Franoni. He is playing Home Improvement. With uh, Go Fish. Everyone for watching, stay safe. Wonderful, wonderful night, and I'll... Bye-bye.